Hey guys, what is up? And um, today I will teach you how to make renders with paint.net. So first thing you're gonna do is obviously go to the website, get paint, get paint.net, or you can just search in your browser, whatever you need to do. There we go. Um, but yeah, so once you have that installed and you have the setup and everything, you make sure you have the render template. Um, I sent it to you, I believe. Or if it's on YouTube, then I, sh I will leave a link in the description. Um, anyways, so you want to open up paint dot, uh, paint.net. Should look like this. You want to hit the plus button right here. Then you want to type in zero one zero two four. Highlight, uh, highlight this. One zero two four. Make them both one zero two four. Then hit enter. I hit control and the letter A at the sem same time and hit M4 on your keyboard or it should say delete. It should be on the right, s right side um, next to F12. It should be labeled M4 or DEL. And you want to just press the button and it'll make it like this. Now you want to drag your render template into here and then you want to add a layer. And then you can move this up one. Now this is where you actually get them. You want to go on to your web browser. Now you want to look up anything. Um, for example, um, it doesn't matter. I will do Braun Strowman. So look up Braun Strowman PNG. Then go to images. And then it has to have that white background there or it won't work. So after you do that, you want to click on it. And then, yeah, it has to have that little checkered background there. So you want to right click. You want to hit copy image. Okay, you can close this now. Now you can click on this once and you can hit control and the letter V. Keep canvas size. Whoa. And then just adjust it. Adjust it how you want it to. So might take a little bit. You just want to get it to a good size. Uh, that should be good. Now you want to uh, click on the render template here and you want to click the X button and it deletes the layer. So you want to click on file top left and you want to click save as and then choose your location. I'll do desktop and save as type. Make sure that is direct draw surface and then you can name it uh, Braun. Stroman and then I'll click save. Now this is very important. You want to make sure these settings are BC3 linear DXT5. You want to make sure the error metric is perceptual or you just want to copy your settings to make it look like this. And you want to make sure the preview file size is one megabytes. Any bigger and it will not work. Once you're done with that hit OK and then um, it's uh, if I close this out right here now you can double click on it and it should open paint on it it might open photos doesn't really matter but yeah there you go so there is how you make a render